Welcome back everyone to the first official returned Manny Lofts. Um, we got Zoe out there, the guard dog, she's chewing away on a bone, but we're going to head out there. Um, we're going to get all the birds out for a fly. Uh, we've got the white one out there that you guys have not seen flying yet, which is one of Raven's babies. Um, going to get him out for a good fly so you guys can check that out. We're going to go through... Um, the birds that we're going to pick for our race we have a race tomorrow morning which is our first official one and then there'll be a separate video so we need to figure out what birds we're going to send and we need to give them a nice little feed and make sure they're all ready for tomorrow um, and we'll check up on those little squeakers in there as well and see how they're going and then we'll just anything else as we go so let's jump into it and see how these birds are going I apologize in advance I've got a really blocked nose, so I sound a little bit different, but that's not going to slow us down. So let's get out there and sort these birds out. So that were all out flying, including the barless. Um, I'm going to do a separate video on how to break in older birds. Um, but for now, they're out there flying somewhere. There they go. And so is that barless hen, but I don't know how good she is at a flyer yet, so we'll just wait and see. you doing you don't like flying in the rain do you you're not too sure about it come on how about you go fly with everyone else come on come on come here come on no you're like your mum you're a bit strange and a bit of a character like your father Come on. Come on, you guys. Come up. Good job trapping super well. Come up. And that's all of his bar, the barless, but she'll turn up a bit later. She's a bit of a funny one at the moment. 
Um, okay, so I'm going to give them a bit of a decent feed now, just so the food starts getting processed into them. Let's clean away. I've got some peanuts here. Peanuts are good for them, so chuck in a handful of peanuts. This is going to be a little post race mix. So hopefully that helps them a little bit. And then I need to put in maybe a handful of peas. Just lost a couple, but the dog will eat them. All right. Let's go out there and give them a feed. You find all those peas? Mmm. Come on. I've got some peanuts and peas. Oh, you got peanuts. So. No nuts. Literally, nuts are uh, funny. So, a little white one, he does alright. He traps quite well and he flies quite well. Doesn't start for as long as the others, but he's doing pretty well, considering. And he's actually got through his final molt now, so he's actually starting to look a bit more like an adult. Like his little comb and his, all his head's starting to look pretty good. He's actually a pretty solid bird. You can probably tell he's quite wide across the shoulders, so might be an interesting bird. Definitely going to get him out in training when he's old enough. You guys pretty much picked all the peanuts out of there first. So I'm probably going to send maybe half these birds. I might send five to six. Um, I'm going to send the checker hen, the checker cock bird, and all the blue bars are in here. So that's probably, I think, five. I think five is what we can send. So we'll send those five. Um, That'll be in a separate video, I'll basket them up and then we'll head up to the club rooms um, and then get them all sorted, which would be pretty cool. It's something different um, and then tomorrow there'll be a separate video, which will basically be the race, so waiting for the birds, clocking them in and whatnot. So don't forget to hit subscribe, drop some comments down below. Um, probably by the time you're watching this we'll be well and truly into the race, so... Fingers crossed these birds do well. It's only 270 kilometers, so it's not a huge race, but it's definitely a challenge for these guys in their first race. But all these ones I'm sending have been out to about 100 kilometers a couple of times, just in training tosses, so they're pretty, pretty fluent in what they need to do. And worst case, they can just follow the other birds, because a couple of the leading lofts are actually close to my area, so hopefully that they will follow those birds. So let's go have a look, um, check out these little chicks and see how they're going. Hey, I'm going to give you some peanuts too. I'll feed your babies on some peanuts, that's good for them. Let's have a look at your little babies. Let's bring them down here so it's easier to see them. Oh, they're getting big and heavy now. Okay, so, bit of a mixed bunch here. Let's have a look at this guy to start with. He's got a bit of white on the back of his head there. It's all white there. All white on the wings. Your chest looks all white too, and you might just have a couple little specks on your under your armpit sort of thing section there, and then you've got a couple here, so that's good. And you're a big chick, look at the size of this thing. Pretty heavy too. Probably think this one's gonna be the male. And then you've got this one, which is a blue bar, because you can see here, I'm just even bring in some better light. There's actually no checker pattern on those feathers that are coming through, so that's going to be interesting color because you can see the the amount of white that's on this thing to the 
to the point where you're not going to tell that's a blue bar anyway because the bars are all covered up in white but look at that wing that's beautiful this is going to be a very interesting looking pigeon I think that might even be this chick's quite dark so it could even be like a smoky blue bar um, but we'll have to wait and see but it could be a light checker as well that might come through a bit later so maybe next week we'll be able to tell you can see how much I actually come in here because they think they're getting fed so they're quite used to me get some nice and tame but oh, look at the front of that that is beautiful you've got almost got like a little bib all the white that goes down there let's get you out for a look at that that is beautiful Yeah, have got a near white head with a few specks on there as well. It looks like that'll be white. Oh, fantastic. Hey, eh? You're going to be beautiful. Anyway, I'm going to catch you guys later. Wish me luck in the race. Drop some comments down below. Um, I'll have a look at them when I get back from basketing tonight. And then we're going to do some racing tomorrow. So, good luck. Birds, see you later.